uh, if we just take a, a, a brief look, the, the point of this example is it, um, it it runs this demo. And in the demo, it'll init the Bluetooth, and then it'll create this LED service. And it, it calls this function on data written when we write data to it. Uh, and if we take a look at that, it'll print what we write, and then it'll uh, actuate an LED based off of the value. So if I go ahead and put that on now, this one I already have compiled, so it's it's quite a bit faster. Nice. So something you can see is uh, Embed Studio. It, it it'll open up a COM port for you. Um, so pretty convenient, and that's what you're seeing down at the bottom of the screen. So we can see already here um, once it's done initting. It'll print the MAC address, so that's what it's doing there. And let me go ahead and open up on my phone and connect to it. You're using the NRF Connect app? Yes. Uh, Fantastic software by Nordic that uh, really works well for debugging BLE and everything re revolving around that. It allows you to act as a central or peripheral device using your phone. Yeah, so this is a, a basic example, but I've connected to it and I wrote the value of one. And you can see that on the serial value of zero. And if I can try and hold this up to the camera, are you guys able to see that? One. Oh, yeah. And, uh, and zero. So kind of a basic Bluetooth example. Uh, but I guess uh, I just wanted to say it's kind of sky's the limit, right? So we wanted to to have some basic examples of, of Bluetooth running. And we, one of the exciting things of these things is, is being able to see what the community is able to create. But uh, I, I did want to point out Embed has uh, a repo that has a bunch of examples on it. This is actually where I grabbed the LED example from. And there's all kinds of examples here. So uh, I, I guess I wanted to give a little shout out to that. Uh, if you just look at the Embed OS BLE examples, that, that's where I got that example from. And if you wanted to try out all these examples, go for it.